Yeah, it's great to see you again, Benedict. We did a session together in Dubai on stage oh, a couple of years nice. ago. Yes, yes, yes. I do yeah, there you awesome. go. Good to see you again. And great to meet you, Sergio. Hey. Okay. So I want to start with each of you talking about each other. Like, what is it that you admire most about each other? And how did you help each other through this oh journey gosh. through the multiverse? Wow. What I admire about myself is... <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, it's incredible, you know, that someone so young at age, you know, she auditioned at 13, arrived at 14, uh, 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 you know, on a film of such magnitude and high expectation, you know, for her to kind of just hit the ground running, you know, has been really uh, fantastic to watch, you know, and I think people are going to be thrilled at this new introduction of uh, America Chavez. So... She's got it all to come. I look slightly jaded from it, obviously. But, uh, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> you have youth on your side. <laughs> I mean, uh, with Benny, you know, on one of the first days I arrived, he like just knocked on my trailer and said, you know, I'm here for you. If you have any questions, just, you know, he was really there for me and he got he gave me his phone number and I was like, oh my gosh, I have Ben Bong's phone number. And I gave it your mom. <laughs> yeah, but it was technically on my phone. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> but no, I mean, it was great to have that kind of support. I mean, cause it was, it was rough, you know, having the pandemic and being isolated. So, you know, we shared a makeup trailer. So it was good to, you know, still be a kid and laugh and have fun. And, you know, with him by my side, it was definitely fun. Um, you know, I mean, there are, par you know, there are parallels to this in, in a way, yeah. in terms of America Chavez that kind of burst through into this reality and I, into I some stormed degree, into set. No. stormed <laughs> in, uh, when you do the like ways, <laughs> no, uh, you know, quite, quite vulnerable, you know, yeah. and, uh, you know, from obviously the MCU world and, you know, coming in and you can only, you know, welcome someone you know especially someone so young at the time you know it's um we lend he a did hand. it perfectly thank you <laughs> i'm sending an invoice to your agent uh i just said <laughs> sorry what are you saying how do you feel this journey has changed each of you i mean because obviously so you're just beginning but this this journey has changed each of you because i mean it's years to grow with this character to turn into kind of an icon with it so how have you felt that personally? Me. Both of us. Oh, yeah. um, awesome. I mean, for me, I've definitely grown on set, obviously. Uh, I just turned 16. I did my first audition when I was 13. So um, definitely lots of learning, and especially from coming from Babysitter's Club on Netflix to this huge blockbuster. I, I had no idea what to do with wires and stuff like that. So, I mean, there's definitely a learning curve with stunts um but also just acting wise i learned a lot from watching the others actresses and uh actors and just seeing what they do and kind of copying it and seeing like what worked best and things like that and um i mean i learned a lot for sure um yeah it's been um you know obviously it's been six years now since i first joined and uh just watching that character progression really you know from this no-nonsense librarian now, you know, and how Portal will travel. We, 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 we've gone through many different uh, films, uh, Infinity War and Endgame and Shang-Chi. And, and now he's the Sorcerer Supreme. So yeah. I, I've, uh, I, I've, uh, I'm thrilled about that. And, um, you know, standing toe to toe alongside Doctor Strange and uh, we'll see where the MCU takes us. <laughs> 